coming the whole month of October, the McBeef Banquet Second Annual Spooktacular! That's gonna scare the pants right off of your dick! It's gonna be spooky. Welcome back. Welcome. Episode yeah. 69, 61, sorry. Um, this week's episode is brought to you by Circle Space. Nope. Which is an, a subsidiary of Square and Triangle Space. No, dude, your podcast isn't even sponsored. Not this week. Guys, Miles is. is such a Debbie Downer. Anyway, um, enough of Miles' pessimism, though. Let's talk about a movie we watched this week. Yeah. Which what was, was it, dude? Uh, ghost Stories. Oh, I thought it was Devil All the Time, I bet. Um, dude, what the fuck? Did you I watch it again? again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just like, oh, you he, he must have said it again. Okay. <laughs> No, we watched Ghost Stories. Mm-hmm. Um, Not to be confused with a ghost story. Or uh, Hawaiian ghost stories. Or Hawaiian ghost stories. <laughs> yeah. Or any other ghost stories related title thereof. There's also an Indian ghost stories that's on Netflix. Indian ghost stories. Not, it's, not, it's not called Indian ghost stories, but it's um, by an oh, indie, Indian? indie director or wow. indie maker. Um, so, uh, what did you think of it? I thought it was... Good. There were definitely some good moments to it. Mm-hmm. Um, I really like the ending of just the the whole motif of the the one shot with like the through the mirror. Oh the yeah, still yeah type thing looking thing or whatever. Mm-hmm. That was kind of cool. Um, because they would show that throughout, and then to bring it back at the end was nice. Um, mm-hmm. uh, let me think. There were a couple shots I really liked. Um. So there was one of the shots was um when he first gets to um the old man's house or whatever or a trailer and it's like mm. um mm-hmm. <laughs> he just like the guy opens the toilet that come doors that come on in and then like there's just a shot of the toilet mm. I don't know what it was about that one shot but like it just <laughs> made me feel like it was like real you know what I mean like it had it was, a, like it was a real toilet like it was just like. I don't know. It just gave me a real like feeling. I don't know why, but <laughs> like yeah, I was just <laughs> I don't know what was about that toilet, but anyway. No, yeah, there was that. That was a good shot. I agree. Um. But no, yeah, there was some some good stuff in there. Um. I guess what did you think of it? I liked it. I think I was a little annoyed at how much. Because at the end, I mean, it was kind of obvious, especially at the end, but at, at, in, in the credits, it said, you know, adapted from a stage play. Yeah. And you could really tell towards the end that it was, like, yeah. a lot of that stuff would obviously be in, probably been, like, a direct transition into the film, almost. Right. Um, which I found kind of annoying, almost. Yeah, I don't know. It just it felt a little bit like, I don't know, they could have done something else, maybe. Yeah. I thought but, so, too. But again, they're doing a a direct. I'm guessing it's like pretty pretty direct uh, transition in, in into film, um, yeah. and like from the beginning, you know, the old man. Uh, what was it, Carm Carmen? Diaz. Yeah. Yeah, dude, you got it. Carmen. Um, Car- Luke San Diego. Luke, San Diego. Car- uh, where in the world is Carmen San Diego? Yeah, exactly. Um, no. Uh, where the fuck is it? Hold on, I'm going on the Wikipedia page. I want to know his his name. Um, it doesn't say. Jesus. Whatever. Okay, okay. So oh, the no. fucking... Oh, no. Cameron. Cameron something. Charles Cameron. Cameron. Yes. Charles Cameron. Got it. Oh. Okay. Charles so, in the beginning, you know, he, he, he met up with Charles Cameron, and that sets up the whole plot of the movie. But I could tell who it was. I was like, okay, so that's Martin Freeman. Got it. Yeah. Yeah. Um. And then when he started pulling off his face, I'm like, oh, okay. So that's so that's happening. All right. Mm-hmm. Um. I mean, I don't know. I I did like it. Yeah, it was good. Um. I I was like, damn, this movie's really trippy. But you know, it's still it's still a good movie. But like, I don't know. I still found it annoying with the whole. Yeah. Um. I thought that too. I just felt like the point of it all was kind of 
insistent, like really just kind of up in your face about it, and that's like makes it feel like it's this grand thing. And I thought it was okay. I just didn't get that interesting of a vibe from it. I guess mm-hmm. I don't know. I like the the um his kind of history with um the one guy, um whatever his name was um Korjak. I think is what they called him. Um, Who? Sorry. You know what I'm talking about? I was I zoned out for a second. What? Co- Korjak? Um, Korjak? What were you? Oh, I just like that that whole story. Uh, um, there was three... Ki- which which story? What, what one were you... Well, like... Well, his, his backstory, really. Or, like, his history. The, um... The I main guess, character? Protagonist, yeah. Uh, yeah... Um, You're being very confusing, Henry. What? I don't know. Did you watch the movie? I did like, watch the movie, but like you do not remember oh when he's like when he goes, he's like it's towards the end where they're at the the little well or oh the, the yes, sewer thing? yes, yeah, yeah. Okay, there you go. You just were be, um, being a little bit confusing to me. Anyway, I mean, if you'd pay more attention. Um, yeah, sorry. <laughs> kidding. Uh, <laughs> what was he saying? Um, I I think one of my favorite things that too is there's like a little moment of um when he's talking to old Martin Freeman in the beginning mm-hmm. and he's like tell that to your um uh, say that for like your wife and kids or whatever and you see like that shot of his reaction it's yeah just, like you you don't have kids or your family or whatever I was like, yeah That's cool <laughs> I like that little moment just kind of like show uh, it's a great visual way to show like an audience mm-hmm. something I like that. I think they brought that up a couple times, but um, yeah, it was alright. Mm-hmm. Um, did you have a favorite of the three stories that was uh, that was that was good? Would you say? I um, I would say the middle one was my least favorite. Yeah. And then between the first and the third one, I guess probably the first one. Mm-hmm. I'd say I, I guess it was agree. a little more scary and also it was probably the longest one I think yeah I, I like the whole shot of like each light going out in the in the background <clears> oh the that, that was good yeah that was nice um and yeah it was yeah it was a little more drawn out than the rest I'd say and like the second one felt a little cheesy it did yeah because it's, it's just a demon Although yeah. I did, I did kind of like that part where like the demon was like holding on to him. It like it was kind of creepy where he just kind of like put his arms out and like just like yeah. don't go. That was yeah. that was cool, but I mean again. And then he just kind of got like, yeah, I guess, sort of. <laughs> I don't even know. I don't know. Like developed by this tree monster thing. Yeah, and it was like really weird with like the parents and he saw someone upstairs. Yeah, yeah, that whole thing was. I, I I almost la- um I almost laughed because, um, when he like goes into the kids' room or whatever, and the kid locks the door, and he's like, "Sit down," and says it like really forcefully. I'm just imagining like I, th- I was expecting him to have like a gun or something. <laughs> <Pointed out. laughs> Sit down, motherfucker. <laughs> or maybe it was like but, a it was like a porn casting couch or something. Yeah. <laughs> um. But anyway. Uh. <clears throat> yeah, that was no. I don't. Yeah, it was very. I don't know. Compared to the others, it wasn't as interesting. Mm-hmm. It felt like, and yeah, it was a little confusing. And the third one was also, um, it was good. Uh, I mean, Mar- Martin Freeman obviously did a pr- pretty good job, but like the whole, I don't know, he was the devil, I guess. Or he was what? He was like <clears throat> Mar- Martin Freeman was like the devil, kind of, or something. Kind of, yeah, or like a, or yeah, he just sort of when he shot himself, he became like I don't know. I have no idea. It was actually quite, quite, quite confusing. So, right, because it's like, well, it's like, it, so, so it never really happened, right? Where it's yeah. Like his head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because like, the whole point, they kept mentioning it, like your brain makes up things, or that you want to see. Yeah, brain makes you see things that you want to see, or something like yeah. that. So, like, um, yeah, he just, yeah, I guess he just kind of represented, um, yeah, passing judgment or. And, mm-hmm. and yeah, and whatever. Yeah, yeah. Um, you guess you believe, but yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I guess uh, acting. Did you like the like the acting or? Yeah. Um, 
trying to think. I don't. I mean, I guess uh, Alex Lawfer, who played Rifkind and the and the Junior Doctor, was. I mean, he did a good job at what he did. I mean, I guess that's what the character demanded. So I mm-hmm. don't know. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I think everyone did a good job, honestly. Yeah, I thought it was good. Um. But, yeah, I guess. I guess I'd, I'd recommend it. Um, mm-hmm. I don't say it's the best movie I've ever seen. For yeah, sure. I mean, yeah. You know, definitely some predictable moments, I feel like. And then mm-hmm. um, I just didn't really, I don't know, I just didn't appreciate the, like, I guess, the point of it all as much. <clears throat> um, mm-hmm. But, you know. And from how it looked, like, it seemed like it had a pretty big budget. Um, so I'm just wondering, like, because... Like, with the way the devil looked, uh, or the demon, sorry, um, and, uh, bless you, that actually scared me, Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> You're fine. Nice. Um, let's see, uh, production budget was 100,000, I think? 100,000? 100, yeah, 100,000. Well, that's, that, I mean, I don't know if that's, no, that's a, ga- a, a ghost story, sorry, Jesus Christ. Oh, yeah. I don't know. It's not going to show up, I think. But um, I feel like it had a, a relatively large budget. <clears throat> um, and I f- and I feel like they could have done like the ghost in the in the first one a little bit better. You know, when at, at the end when he's when the story is about to end. You know. Yeah. Um, because it's just like a just a little girl in makeup, mm-hmm. and you know the demon's just a demon with makeup. Right. Um, or a man in makeup, you know. But um, I don't know. I, I kind of wish they had done a little bit better of a job with that. But Yeah. And again, the whole the whole ending thing feels very much like it was a, a stage play. Yeah, I'd say so too. So. Um, and yeah, and that and even like you said about the makeup and stuff, it's just, you know, I feel like it's all more... It probably works better as a stage play. Yeah, I kind of um, would want to see it as a stage play because that was yeah probably w- w- would be better. Because even like when when um, M- Martin Freeman is pulling off his prosthetics, it's like <laughs> like <laughs> in my head, I'm like, oh, M- I guess M- Martin Freeman doesn't want to be in the movie anymore. He's taking off his prosthetics and leaving. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's what I was. <laughs> it's just kind of funny. Oh, you're <laughs> you're getting bullshit. up and leaving. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Um. But yeah. Yeah, we we would recommend it. It's a it's a it's a it's a good movie. Um, I mean, I would say it's like like better as a stage play, probably. Yeah, but definitely. We we don't we haven't seen the stage play, so we don't we we don't know. We don't we wouldn't know, but we we think it probably would be. But I guess if you've never seen a stage play before, watch this. <laughs> yes, indeed. Watch it. <laughs> yeah. Um. Yeah. I did have to look up also what a punch and Judy was. Really? You didn't know? Yeah, I, yeah, I did not know what that was. <laughs> Which it's just like a puppet show basically. Yeah, like a yeah. One man like puppet show, I guess. Mm-hmm. I don't remember what the context was though. Um, it was when he was talking to the first guy. The oh like, yeah yeah yeah. Guy. Like professors, they, they're the kind of person to do a one uh, like a punch and Judy. Mm-hmm. Like, what the hell does that mean? <laughs> Um, so I liked it up. Yeah. So I learned something new. But yeah. I thought there was something else I wanted to say about it, but I already I I, I forgot. So. Yeah. You forgot. Of course yeah. you did. <clears throat> of course you did. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Anyway. Yeah, it's a good movie. Yeah. Check good it movie. out. Recommend. Um, did you watch anything this week? Um, did you watch anything this week? I did. What did you watch? Uh, Connor, I didn't watch anything. Okay, Connor and I watched uh, Halloween Town, which we've oh, yeah? which we've both seen before. Yeah, um, many it's times classic. probably. Yeah, um, it's on Disney Plus. So yep. is the rest of the series. That's a plus. Um, <laughs> Disney Plus. And then you went uh, all red. I didn't realize that. I think yeah, you're wearing a red shirt. No, I've got red shorts on, dude. Matching. I got a match. Nice. Yeah, I got a match. Um, and then. You don't have to if you don't want. 
I do, Miles. In my in my head, I feel like people complain though. If you don't match, in my head. Well, who cares if they complain? They're I not know. The one I know. Was wearing the clothes. I know. Um, if they want to match, then they should wear their own damn make their own damn clothes match. All right. <laughs> okay. Um, you do you. All right. All right. Thank you. And then I also watched uh, an actually like it wasn't like a fantastic movie, but it's definitely worth checking out. It's fantastic, called Mr. Fox. No. Um, it's called Slice. Have you heard of it? No, just called Slice. Um, Slice of Life, okay. And it's on Prime as well as uh, Canopy. Um, and it's got Chance the Rapper. Who, really? Who I okay. really, I think he's really, uh, actually a pre- pretty good actor, but maybe not in this one. But um, I, I think he's funny because he, he did SNL before and it was actually a yeah. good episode of SNL. Yeah. Um, okay. Anyway, it's got Chance Bennett, Chance, Chance, Chance the Rapper, um, and it also has uh, Zazie Beetz, who was in uh, nice. Dead, Deadpool 2, um, yep. Atlanta, um, yeah. and Joe Keery, but he plays a very small part, um, right. who was in Stranger Things. Stranger, um, stronger Things. Stronger Things. Uh, and it's like, it's got like, you know, ghosts, super, it's like a very, like, kind of supernatural, I don't know, it's, it's like funnier i think than it is like horror or anything else but yeah i thought it was good um not fantastic but it was good not quite like fantastic mr fox but close yeah dude yeah you got it bro bet nice and i think that's um (laughs) that's it Sorry, yeah, yeah, that's it. I just found a really cool poster of like it's pizza boxes, and it, the tagline says "dead in thirty minutes or less." And then at the bottom it yeah. says like all the ingredients. It's got hell, ghosts, witches, cheese, tiny town, crooked cops, werewolves, murders, and then the one that the only one that isn't checked is a way out alive. <laughs> um, that sounds like a like a something for Eli. Yeah, dude. Um, definitely. Uh, yeah, yeah. That's all I watched. Cool. Sadly. Alrighty. Well, that's it then. All right. I'll all see right. You guys never. All, all right. Just kidding. Cool. What? You <laughs> you were kidding? Dude. Twas you tw- y- y'all be as hoodwinked. You didn't do. We didn't do that last week at all. No, we didn't. No. Of course wow. Not. We're our jokes, they're good, man. We Never never days. we never run out of jokes. But anyway. <coughs> we're did we do that last week? I feel like we did that the week we before. We did. We no. did do it last week, I'm pretty sure. That was the week before. Man. This, One this of week them. has been so long for me. <laughs> um okay. Well, next week we're watching a movie. Yeah. It's on Tubi. I don't oh know how my this is gonna God. go. But it should be interesting. <laughs> um But yeah, it's on Tubi. I don't know if it's on anywhere else. I haven't checked, but I know it's on Tubi for sure. So it is for sure free you can, if you have Tubi. But anyway, uh, <clears throat> it is called The Black Cat, and it's based on a, that Edgar Allan Poe story. Um, came out in 2017. The Black Pussy. The Black Cat. Yeah. Which year? 81? There was an 81 one, but I think this one, this one looks like it's 2017. 2017. I was trying to find it on like Google, but I couldn't. I yeah, I'm trying to right now actually. Uh, it's a short film. No, there's yeah, I saw that too, but oh, there's okay. uh, it's yeah, I don't know. Um, I'll just look for it on Tubi apparently. Yeah, it is on Tubi. <clears throat> yes, thank you, dude. Thanks, man. <laughs> no problem, Miles. Uh. The black pussy. <laughs> funny, dude. I'm so funny. Is it like kind of like a black and white kind of poster? Oh, I just uh, yeah. 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 2017. Weird. Yeah, I don't know why it's not showing up anywhere else, but but it's on there. So yeah, there's that. This looks good, dude. <laughs> I, I didn't really think so. <laughs> but we'll find out. Yeah, that was I sarcasm, guess. by the way. 
Okay. <laughs> Why can't I find it? Why is it not on Google? Because it's not that good. Obviously. Google. Okay, wait. I'll look up Brace Bel Tempo. We're gonna fi- we're gonna find this. Okay, we're gonna find gonna this find it, on right? Google. Make sure there's n- it's not anywhere else. It's an impossible cause, Miles. Why does he not record? <laughs> the fuck. Ah. Director, what have you directed before? Oh, because it's under a different name, apparently. Oh, is it? What is it called? Poe 4, The po Black four, Cat. The Revenge of Post Mom. <laughs> post, post Malone. Poe 4, The Black Cat. Mm, what the fuck? <laughs> I don't know why it's called Poe 4. Is it like, I guess it's just a series of stuff? I don't know. Maybe. A... Uh, what? I'm so confused. What kind of name is Brace anyway? <laughs> oh yeah, that, We're gonna that watch is it. weird. <laughs> Don't expect good things from it though. Okay, Po Four. <laughs> Maybe it's four. Italian. <laughs> no, it's Po Four, the Black Cat. Miles, get it right. I'm saying maybe it's maybe it looks like it's possibly Italian. Let's find it's out. It's got some weird names. <laughs> that's that's me. Yeah, that's that's me. <laughs> That, that is really mean. I'm just kidding. Uh, I'm sorry. I don't know, man. I didn't mean it. Okay, okay. Yeah. I appreciate all cultures. Po Poetry of Erie? This isn't the one before it. No, it isn't. Nope. It has nothing nope. to do with it. Nope. Cool. Nope. Nope. I'm nope. so glad. Film series. There's a series of films called Poe, but it's... Okay, you know what? I'm done. I'm done looking at this. We're going to watch it. Because but... <clears throat> I'm not finding anything exactly. I want to find, so... With it. I'm, not fi- yeah. I'm not finding what I want to find, dude. So. You don't know what, Miles? It's just a task and, and uh, it's a it's a lesson and accepting defeat, Miles. Okay? That's true. It's all right. That's true. Okay. Okay. It's good. Good. Yeah. So watch Po Four. The Black the Cat. Black Cat. It's on Tubi. on Tubi. Only on Tubi. I think, as far as we know. Yeah. Or elsewhere, we don't know. I doubt it, though. Anyway, yeah, that's that. So, thanks for listening slash watching and yeah don't forget to take care of your black cat oh fuck dude i haven't been recording this whole time what haha <laughs> jk got Dang you it, pranked Miles. you pranked you scared you because it's almost halloween oh shit. oh shit i was so mad i am sure you would have been if i didn't <laughs> okay. oh my god like 20 minutes so, uh, that long, I guess. Yeah. Okay. Just be annoying. Yeah, I'm. I'm a super annoying guy. So, so I, I get it. Yep. Yeah, you are. Not. Not anymore. You're gonna kill me. Not. Anymore. I said, yeah, you are. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. I am. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Not anymore. Okay. Cool. Uh, <laughs> thanks for thanks for checking us out, boys and girls. <laughs>